You know, the Republicans in New Hampshire want to keep talking about how there's a fiscal emergency. You know, they need to rein in spending. I have a great idea. Release all the peaceful people from your cages. I'll start closing some of these uh, jails down. Uh, allocate your uh, law enforcement resources to uh, where there are actual crimes and there's actual victims. Hello, my name is Jason Talley and I'm the Managing Director of the Civil Disobedience Evolution Fund. Uh, it's, uh, you can find us on the web at cdevolution.org and basically we support the good people who disobey bad laws. We live in the Shire and that's, a, that's essentially the area that we cover. We, we don't go anywhere. We want to encourage people to, uh, to move here and uh, when, they, when they are here to um, uh, not comply with bad laws and uh, you know, commit uh, civil disobedience whenever uh, their conscience leads them to do so. When I first moved here, the uh, board of directors of the Civil Disobedience Evolution Fund uh, approached me and uh, asked me if I would be interested in the gig. And it was just really something that I couldn't say no to because I have a, a great deal of admiration for the people that will uh, do the right thing even if uh, it could mean uh, punishment from, uh, from the government, from the state. So I try to explain to people, just because something is uh, uh, illegal doesn't mean that it's immoral. And, just because you're a quote law-abiding citizen doesn't mean you're a good guy or a good gal. And so uh, we want to differentiate uh, and we want people to act morally. A lot of people that commit civil disobedience, they, uh, they have their kindred spirits with people like Martin Luther King uh, Jr., Gandhi, you know, all peaceful people. Um, and that's the people I associate with, that's the people that the CD Evolution is going to help. Peaceful people. Um, who have their own sense of morality and it doesn't need to be dictated to them by uh, people in Washington DC or people um, in the New Hampshire capital. Well, there is a long history of uh, civil disobedience um, in, in America, but we have the benefit these days of uh, being able to use social media. Uh, a lot of us, uh, we are the media. Uh, I have uh, another one of my projects is uh, tally.tv and um, Civil Disobedience Evolution Fund sponsors us. The best thing that I think that CD Evolution can do is get the word out about the civil disobedience that does take place, their trials, uh, what people need. Uh, CD Evolution fills uh, commissary accounts. Uh, in certain circumstances, we may bail people out. And one thing we started to do is um, having uh, independent websites for uh, some of these uh, good activists because there's just so much information. We want to give a single URL so that people can learn about cases. There's uh, weedaclause.com, for example, will uh, lead you to information where you can watch videos, uh, read blog posts. For Weedaclaws, you can uh, send him mail while he's in a cage. I'm working on a website now, noplea.cdevolution.org. One thing that we're working with, a lot of great activists, especially in uh, the Free Keen area, is uh, encouraging people not to take the plea deal. To take the plea deal, that does all the state's work for them, and they need to make their case. But a lot of times, people just want to uh, make it all go away, um, but it doesn't. It perpetuates the system. And so by more and more people saying no, then uh, maybe they'll stop harassing people for these victimless crimes, which the books are just full of uh, silly crimes that uh, incarcerate peaceful people. So there are a lot of ways that you can um, help the Civil Disobedience Evolution Fund. Uh, fund is the last word in our title, so of course we'll gladly accept your donations. It could be one-time donations or you can make regular contributions. That lays the groundwork for when they do get here. Um, you know, we would like it to be a, a safer place for them, um, which happens when more and more activists do move here. If the Civil Disobedience Evolution Fund can create these support networks, I think more and more people will uh, finally say no and the state won't be able to get away with their aggression. If you want to uh, help support the uh, good people who disobey bad laws, just go to cdevolution.org. You can read stories about our uh, brave activists here in the Shire, and uh, if you want to uh, support us in any way, uh, we would very much appreciate it. You've made liberty your life's goal, but something seems to be missing. Stickers from libertystickers.com. Exercise your freedom of speech with the world's most dangerous bumper stickers. That's libertystickers.com. I never considered myself a lefty, but uh, you know they have this uh, saying that I've heard many times: "No justice, no peace." And that's, I think, that's right on the money. That you know they won't see us um, if they would just uh, leave peaceful people alone.